Are we sure as hell can't go outside? Let's let, let's stay calm, okay? Um, let's let's go find Caitlin and everybody, okay? Okay, yeah. Okay. Oh my God! Like why? All right, welcome back. We're back with some more at the quarry. Starting chapter five. White noise. If you can make sure you like and subscribe, and if you are a returning viewer, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you, if you haven't seen the previous video, I advise you to go check it out before you check out this one so you can catch up with the story. Hit the link on the right side of the screen. Hey, I couldn't find anything to eat. The kitchen's pretty cleaned out. Oh, shoot, I left my bag. I just realized she got bit too. I, I brought you this. So they're both going to turn. That was... I forgot about that. Fuck. I don't even know what happened. I'm talking about Nick, and I forgot Abigail got bit too. How are you feeling? Remarkable, not bitter. You ran away. Uh, let me see what happens. I put bitter. You ran away. What? It jumped on me, and you ran away. You just left me there. Nick, I, 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 I didn't know what to do. I mean, I thought. What you'd rather I, just save yourself, huh? I no, no. I, Okay, maybe I should have tried to understand that she is a chick and she got scared. I just wanted to see what his reaction was gonna be. <laughs> All right, they're off to find a radio or something. What's with the um? The, oh, uh, we found another in Mr. H's office, so just in case. Wait, what is that? Oh, what happened to the lights? Not sure. Any better? I'm doing okay. Kinda. Wait, are they going to the radio hut? Phone's dead. They're gonna try to send out an SOS or something. We're holding down the fort. I just hope that cop doesn't show up. Uh oh. Stay quiet. Stay quiet. Just stay quiet. I thought you said Dylan and Ryan already left. Stay here. I'll check it out. Oh, gosh. Don't go. It's dangerous. Reassuring. We'll be fine. Just be careful. Nah, hell no. Don't go out there. We don't know what's out there. I'm trying to keep everybody that's cool Dangerous. alive. Yeah, that's why I'm gonna check it out. Oh, come on, Caitlyn. Damn. But I think Caitlyn, I, I'm, I feel like the actress is familiar. She looks familiar. I think she was in Zack and Cody. Sweet life of Zack and Cody. Oh crap. Oh, we finally get to play us. Um, damn, what that is in her hand? A musket? Oh, it's a shotgun. <laughs> it's a long shotgun. Maybe she's just so small she makes a shotgun look like look like it's uh Should she even know how to use it? I wanna get jammed on her. Right, I hope nothing happens to Caitlyn, because I like Caitlyn. Uh oh, something's coming from the chimney. I hear something rustling around in the chimney though, but hopefully nothing happens right now. Oh no. This big bubble. Yo, you know what I think? After seeing him take that shotgun blast, like it was like a little tickle to him. I think he may be infected too. He may have whatever um Nick may be infected with now. And it, that's probably why he's probably like invincible too or some weird crap. Cause that shotgun blast should have took him out. Where's that old white dude that's with him too? There's an old little redneck dude that was wiping blood on his face. You know, it was in chapter two. Oh yeah, he's outside with him. Uh oh. 
Okay. Dang, this man came with a sniper rifle. He put the shotgun outside and came with that. Dang. Oh, crap. I gotta hold my breath. Oh, I don't wanna mess this up. Oh, no. And he's sweating, too. Oh, man. Oh, no. Come on, man. Wait, what's gonna happen? Oh. Did she drop the gun? Oh, uh, he got the shotgun. Now, how did that happen? I know he's not a musician. Hey, so this may not be like the best time per se, but like. What? Yeah, so like I was just, you know, thinking about like the start of summer and when we first met and started camp and. Well, like now that summer's over and you know is that like the last time we're gonna see each other you know oh, sorry Can we worry about what, get out getting out of here first hey don't worry about caitlin she's tough i know i'm sorry nick i'm just distracted let's just get through the night okay Maybe I was misreading the situation back there, but I kind of felt like a little bit more was going to happen. Well, did you want a little bit more to happen? Are we really talking about that done? now? Hey. Sorry. What the hell is going on with mean, him? Of course I wanted it to happen. I just didn't I'm know. Is it do you dumb? <laughs> Why are you so aggressive? It seems like such a long time ago now. Oh, sheesh. You didn't want it to happen though. We're gonna uh, rape um, her? Damn. You can tell me. Yeah. I, I don't think I she wants it now. Like, that was. <laughs> Just saying that because I'm hurt. Yeah, Nick. something's up with Nick. Nick's being a little too aggressive right now. I think his brain is getting. Oh, what was that? What's going on out there, Caitlin? I think Nick's brain is being affected. We have to hide. It's okay, I got this. I'm still curious of how he got that damn shotgun. Oh my god. What happened? Jesus, where's the gun? <laughs> Ask him. We have to hide. Run. Uh let's see what happens when we hide. Cause there's not really anywhere we can go. I have a feeling the old man may be outside waiting for us. This dude is like a retired WWE superstar. Like the big show uncle or something. <laughs> Leave, 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 leave. Oh no. Oh no. You look a damn you strong. Uh. Oh, you're mine. Sir, why are you sweating? Oh, damn. Damn, Nick. Holy crap, is he lifting him up? Is Nick Superman? I think Nick is Superman, he never told us. That man has to be about 380 pounds. He just licked him, he literally just lifted him up like it was nothing. Nick gotta be like a good 110. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, it used to be more of a actual radio station actually. Um, uh, it, you know, I mean, it, it is still technically, but nobody brings their radio to camp anymore. Yeah. 
It's weird actually that there used to be kids with their radio. A lot of creatures out there. And everything and, you know, Where's nowadays, Jacob? Everything we need is on the phone, but Mr. Hackett takes it on the first day at camp so that we're not distracted by technology. Um, technology. It giveth and it taketh. Um, okay. So is is that something like that you want to go into? Camp radio? No, like uh, DJ music. Oh damn. Oh, um, yeah. I mean, I like music. Why is he like walking so I damn think fast? I'm a major in um, quantum physics. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you don't really seem like a science guy. <laughs> oh yeah, I mean, you know, not not here. Um, what just happened? I'm I'm sorry. I'm so completely fascinated by this. What do you mean by not here? Not here at camp. I do that at home, and then here I um. You're a wise, wise cracking smartass. <laughs> Uh, that's a little harsh, but... Uh, no? Okay, so maybe I was a little nervous when I arrived in an uncomfortable social situation, and I overcompensated a little bit by making a bunch of jokes. You played into it. Yeah, I mean, people kind of enjoyed the blasé Dylan. Uh, and do, do you enjoy the blasé Dylan? <laughs> Not nah, yeah, like you know, whatever, man. It's pretty cool. It's fine. <laughs> I love how they're just standing there um, when they I should like just be Dylan literally Dylan. talk while we get well, to the it's damn nice place. To meet you, Dylan. Dylan, I'm Ryan. Ryan. Well, actually, I'm. Let's get the fuck out of here, Ryan. Yeah, can we do that? Yeah, I like him. He's that makes a lot of sense. Thank you. For that damn creature back there tearing my whole back off. Where are we going? Oh crap, hold on, let me see something. What's this? Clue discovered, information sign post. Though this is a novelty signpost, it also acts as a chilling reminder that Haggard's quarry really is a long way from anywhere. Okay. So I heard that it was also, there's like a bunch of timelines in this game or something like that. Because like a bunch of uh, things play a part in this, like in the story. What is this? Like a bunch of evidence that play a part in the story. Clue discovered, letter to camp nurse. Chris Hackett has written a note to the camp nurse suggesting she take off a day early. Surely that's a little irresponsible when kids are still around. Okay. That's why Nurse Kelly went home early. But who left that there though? That's a weird spot to have a letter. Where is this guy? Um, what else we got out here? Um, what was that tarot card? The devil, Lord Jesus. The devil without risk restrictions, like a shadow torn from one's corporal form. Pay attention. Pay close attention tonight before the demons at least. Each of us have one, even those who are pure of heart and say their prayers by night. So just to let everybody know, I'm a Christian. Um, some of the stuff I see sometimes in these video games is very weird. Um, I am the type of person that there's certain games I don't really play. Like, you know, just for the reason that because of the demonic stuff that they have in some of these games. Like, I'm not into none of this stuff, this tarot reading card crap. I'm not a not with all that stuff at all i'm totally against it the game is really good i can play a game but also have um the awareness of what it is i'm playing some people are playing games and they don't really know what it is 
that they're playing. So some of the stuff I've seen, it's not really good. Oh crap, just like that ain't good. What was that? Where did he go? What's this over here though? Hold on. Am I supposed to be following following Ryan or am I supposed to just be doing my own thing? I ain't got no light. Hold on, let's go up in here real quick. Hold on. I don't even know why I came in here. I don't think there's anything in here. Yeah, there's nothing in here. Hold on, wait. No, I took. Uh, take that back. Freak show. Okay, we seen this earlier. All right, let's get out of here. Hold on, I can't see Jack, man. Okay, there you go. All right, let's go outside. Where is um, Ryan at? Oh, he's right here. All right, let's go this way. Yeah, man, there's a lot of stuff that you see in games nowadays. Some people just look at it like it's normal. They don't know the origin or the... Uh, they don't have much information on some of the things that they put in games, so they just automatically... Just go with it. All good? Uh, confident. I'm oh, sorry. Give me a minute. No, yeah, we good. All good? Hack is Corey Camp Radio Hut. Okay, when I was a camper here, it was barely working. It hadn't been used for years, and it took me a really long time, actually, to get this place cleaned up and looking the way it is. So, I'm sorry if it's not up to your standards, but I've been putting in a lot of TLC. Okay, okay. okay. Let me get this set up. All right. Anything over here we can use? The power tools? No. Um, that's Mr. H wanted more storage, so that's kind of how he lets me keep the station going. <laughs> gotcha. So, uh, how far does it go? Oh, um, well, it was designed just to broadcast to the PAs around camp for announcements and to, you know, portable radios and whatever. So, I think the range is about a mile. Uh, how do you even know all this stuff? Uh, I just kind of picked it up. Hmm. The tech technical stuff has always been a little uh, hard for me to get a handle. Can we on. get to like the SOS well, or if you like, thing I part? You trying to get help? Like a class? Sheesh. Yeah, it's easy. Like climbing. Sign me up, teach. Boring. <laughs> Anyways, this thing's gonna need a bit of a power up, um, but that's where this comes in. That's magnet. It's supposed to be a signal booster. It's kind of janky looking, but it's worth giving a shot. So, we can actually talk to people with this thing? Yeah, well, it's not a two way radio, so, um, you know, we can talk, uh, but then the best we can do is switch it over to the receiver and see if anyone broadcasts anything back which is unlikely but well it, i mean it is what it is i guess yeah so what should i say uh just like make it sound urgent okay hello how's it going out there this is uh, uh we need help this is uh we are counselors <laughs> oh, wow. at hackett's quarry summer camp and there's been a horrible accident attack, some stuff bad here. We need your help. Uh, there is a swarm of bears, and they are everywhere. Yeah, because they're and really going to believe that. Too, and they seem to be shooting at the bears, but also at us, um, which is not good. And a few of our friends are hurt, and um, we are in desperate need of help. So please, I mean, there's vicious bears, and uh, we don't know what to do. So please 
Uh, come help us, SOS. Brian <laughs> looking at him like, uh, really, nigga? An emergency, S save our <laughs> ship. Come on down, please help us. <laughs> looking at him like, really? Yeah, I do good. Is that swarm of bears? Really, Don? Yeah. Really, Dylan? Herd of bears. <laughs> yeah, I've heard of bears. But... Oh, my God. All right, I, I guess I should just like switch this over to the receiver and see if we get anything back. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm gonna keep an eye out while you do all this techie stuff. <laughs> okay, yeah, sure. Oh crap, that's a creature. Get away from the window. Oh, oh, let me guess. You don't see that, Ryan. I'm guessing Ryan gonna act like he didn't see it. Wait, did he, did he say lodge? I don't know. Hold on. Two males in the radio shack near the cabins. Another couple unaccounted for. Copy that. Um, no. Uh oh. Holy shit, they're talking about us. I think that's the dudes. How? Because we just told them on the fucking radio. Fuck. Uh oh. We have been compromised. <laughs> you know where we are, man. We can't stay here. Shit. Shit. Well, we sure as hell can't go outside. Let's, let, let's stay calm, okay? Um, let's, let's go find Caitlin and everybody, okay? Okay, yeah. Okay. Oh my god, like why didn't Ryan tell him that thing was outside? Why didn't you tell me that? Exactly. Aggressive. There's something off about Ryan. I, I, I wasn't sure, man. Fuck, what the fuck was that? I have no idea. There's something weird about Ryan, like it's something he knows. Oh crap. Oh, it's on the roof. Uh, Ryan? If I was you, Ryan, I'd get that oh, shotgun ready. Bear? I don't think bears can bear's can, that man said it's a bear. If that's the, a bear, that, that bear got like Mike shoes on. <laughs> Is he jumping out the gym if he on the um, roof? I'm surprised I didn't bust out the window. Oh crap. What was that? What is that? Yeah, I wouldn't go near the windows. What? Caitlin, Abby, and Nick. Oh, They're okay, cool, cool. Path. Oh, shit. They're coming toward us. We, we, we gotta warn them. Um. What about the PA? Up top? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, we can tell um, them to hide or something. Yeah. Uh, oh, fuck, no. Wait, what? Oh, shit. Uh, the, uh, hold the what button. What just happened? Uh, Caitlin, get into a building now. Do not come up here. There's an animal outside the radio hut. Get, in, get, uh, get into a cabin now. Go, go, go. Oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> They're gone. We can always get um Nick to fight him. Nick and um Emma. I mean Nick and Emma. Nick and um Abigail to fight. They got strength. <laughs> what now? Oh, we're gonna have to kill it, man. We got a shotgun. We gotta kill it. It's not a normal animal, man. I don't think a gun's gonna cut it. Uh, let's go for it. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? I don't know, man. I just don't think it's a good idea to go running. I mean, out if guns Dylan, dies, Dylan dies, Dylan dies. Really super animal. <laughs> what, what the hell else can we do? 
Well, if it's got hearing, like a like a dog, maybe. Uh, I mean, we could we could play a really high pitched feedback loop and crank it. To Ooh, the that's max. pretty smart. I mean, it would hurt like hell. Like but... some quiet place type crap. Okay, fine. Let's do it. Feedback thing. Alright, let's just be calm. Hey, Dylan, just take a breath. I'm sure you can figure it out. Okay, yeah. Right. Always gotta keep your composure in tough situations. There's something missing. I do. What's missing? Okay, now you need to hurry your ass up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Oh, crap. <laughs> Oh, you Fix gotta kill me. I'll cover you. Do it now. Go quickly. That thing probably gonna snatch him up. Oh, oh. Oh. Oh my god. Holy crap. Uh shit. Fuck. Holy crap. Okay, okay, okay. Just, just hang on, hang on. Oh man. Use a shotgun. Use a shotgun. Uh damn, do I want to use a chainsaw? If I use a chainsaw, I might get no, this is a chainsaw. Ladies and gentlemen, this is about to get messy. It's about to get messy. Oh man, that was brutal. That was brutal. Get the wire, get the wire, get the wire. He's finna pass out. He about to pass out. Keep pressure on He gonna pass out. He taking it though. He gonna pass out. I'm surprised he didn't pass out already. What do I do? What do I do? The button, the button. He's taking it though, like it's. Oh, it worked. Oh, we blew the speaker. It did the trick. Uh... Nice work, Dylan. <laughs> well, that got out of hand. <laughs> uh... Thanks for the oh, oh crap. Okay. Thanks for the help, Dylan. Shut I really up. needed a hand. <laughs> Why'd you do that? You told me to. Oh crap. Oh, I'm idea. stupid. Well, Dylan is smart. He gonna. He's really handy. <laughs> oh crap. Oh, I'm reassuring. I think we're okay for now. We ran into one of those hunter guys. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, chase us out of the lodge. I think we lost him on the way up here. You get a message out? I think so. Great. What the hell was going on at... Oh, my God. Dylan, what happened? Oh, um... <laughs> I'm okay. I, I, I mean, I was surprised he hasn't like. No, um, is he gonna fight? It's, it doesn't doesn't hurt. Okay, you're in shock. Holy fucking shit! It doesn't shit. hurt because he's Does that, infected. Do this? No. Well, sort of. It, it... What the hell was that? Caitlin, where's your gun? I lost it. One of the friendly locals wanted to say hi. What the fuck? 
Did you shoot at what us? What the hell was that? Who the hell is Who's that? There? Oh, we got more characters? Who was she? Should we follow her? It was like an all out war between the... <laughs> It's like, where the hell did she come from? <laughs> Did she die? Ah, oh, shit, Dylan. What is that? Is that a blood? <gasps> oh, my oh, oh my God, is that Jacob? <gasps> Please tell me that's Jacob. They're not even gonna show us who it is, or anyway. And somebody's out there still watching us. Oh no, that's just the camera panning away. I hope that's not copyrighted music, Gil. I have this damn game in streamer mode, but for some reason I'm still getting copyrighted music. Well, here we go. Crow looking like, welcome back. <laughs> Looks like that's one less vermin in the world. Let's take a look once more. I think the lady killed whatever that was that was after us and it just died the and devil. it turned into a human back to a human without restrictions like a shadow torn from one's corporeal form pay close attention and act before the demons unleashed each of us have one even those who are pure of heart and say their prayers by night I want to show you more. Would that be all right? Yeah, I guess. Uh, let's see what she got. Okay, that's Abigail. That's Dylan. Oh, damn. That's Abigail's head. We spend so much time looking toward the future. It's easy to forget that the past holds secrets, too. Worth remembering that. So it's goodbye again. I'll be here. I'll wait for you. Yo, that was Abigail's head. That's crazy. All right, so we're going to be playing as Jake the next episode, chapter six. We're going to be starting next episode. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it, man. That's crazy. Um, but like I said, I'm still going to go with my theory. I think that everybody that gets bit by that creature or whatever the hell it is, is getting infected by it and they're going to turn. Um, I think whatever that was that the lady with the eye patch killed was what was on top of the roof of the, uh, the, uh, cabin. So I have a feeling that, um, I think Nick is going to turn and I think... Dylan may turn based off what she showed on the tarot card thingy. I think Dylan might end up killing Abigail. We don't know. That's I'm just going based off what she's shown. But we're going to get into the gameplay next time. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you watched the whole gameplay, I really appreciate you. God bless you. And uh, like I said before, make sure you like and subscribe. It helps my channel grow. And now uh, that being said, I'll see you guys next time. I'm about to get up out of here. I am DJJ Game. Peace and blessings.